My name is Victoria Ibezim Ohairi. I work with Spaces for Change based in Lagos, Nigeria. As you can see from some of the things that have happened in my country, Nigeria, protests a lot. Um, the one that is most popular, the NSAS protests, when it happened, we saw the Top of the type of harsh pushbacks that even repressed our spaces even further. So, for some of us who identified with that protest, who felt that it was imperative for young Nigerians to resist increasing levels of police brutality, increasing stereotypes, increasing profiling of young people, which resulted in massive repression of their civic freedoms. Because we identify with that, we are, are still. Um, determined to hold those that were involved in repressive practices accountable. Accountability means an assurance that repression will not continue and will not be repeated by those who are responsible for them, be they state actors, be they non-state actors, be they corporations, be they businesses, private actor collaborators of the government that enable the spaces where we operate to be closed or to narrow them down. So accountability requires the removal of legislative regulatory hindrances that target us, that inflict very harsh consequences for the um, expression of civic freedoms. And accountability also means making sure that people who are often targeted get the protections they need from the judicial system. Accountability finally means that those judicial systems that we look up to for protection remain uncompromised and are not undermined by political interference and other forces that make it difficult for us to assess recourse mechanisms.